stunt boy. <laughs> yeah. All right, everybody. Uh, this is me and Tammy, and uh, I was talking to somebody here a while back, and some mentioned something about fatwood or or uh, lightered wood or pitch wood or all kinds of different names that it can have, and I figured I'd show y'all firsthand what it is. Uh, basically, you see this stump right here. Well, no, you don't, because I wasn't looking at it. But you see this stump right here in the ground. Um, this is kind of a small one, but the it this is this is fatwood, uh, and how you know is is how hard it is. Fatwood is what it is is it's a pine tree that's died, and the uh, the sap settles down into the bottom of it, and turns into resin. Almost it just gets hard as a rock, and that's how you can tell it's fatwood. Is when you find a stump like this and you kick it, and it's absolutely so solid that it won't move. There's a good chance that it's fatwood. So what you got to do is you got to get into it, and then once you bust it apart, you can really tear, tell. I'm going to hand the camera off to Tammy, and I'm going to bust this, and then I'll show you what it looks like on the inside. <clears throat> All right, I'm going to take the camera back, or Tammy can do it. Okay. All right, now you see what that looks like. It looks almost wet, and if you could smell it, it literally, uh, it smells like just the, the, yeah, Tammy just said gas. She whispered it. You can speak out loud, babe. But uh, it smells like, like gasoline or, or turpentine, and that's what it is. It's just the pine resin has soaked down in here so much and so deep, and this is heavy. I mean, this little piece weighs, I don't know what, but it's just heavy and dense. Now then, let me show you what this is good for. I'll take that little sliver off right there. And it doesn't matter if it doesn't matter if it is raining. Yeah, and here it is gonna wind's gonna blow it out. It doesn't even matter if it's raining absolutely cats and dogs, if the ground in which it has been this ground is wet, or how wet it gets, this will burn. You can literally go run this under you see the black smoke it's giving off. And it will burn no matter what. So if you find this when you're out and about in the woods, you found fire. Um you can always get a fire going with that, and I better put it out or I'll catch this pasta. And I mean, you can take your knife and skin off pieces of this, and if I light this whole thing up, once it gets going, there ain't no putting it out. Well, it'd be nice if I could do it without the wind blowing it. Yeah, there you go. And literally, once this stuff gets going, once it gets... Uh, I'm out all the time. I was going to show you, light it up and get it burned again so you can hear it sizzle. And you can hear the, 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 the sap sizzle. And it's windy out here today, so I'm having a little bit of a hard time. That's all right. I got it. But anyway, that's what fat wood is. That's how you get it. And that's what you can do with it. And uh, it absolutely burns like nothing else. Once you get a few pieces of this going at the same time and get it get a little bit of heat going there ain't no putting it out so anyway that's enough for today i'll talk to y'all later